Ladies and gentlemen, this is Mampolo from Mampolo's Corner. Renee, your mindset. In this current time in life, evil that men do lives with them. <laughs> that one that talks, evil, evil that men do live, live after them. Or when they don't die, finish. Now their children go they go they inherit and alive. Now now, as they do the evil, <laughs> don't worry. You don't go past five years, ten years, two years, three years, four years. Don't worry, you go they, you go they, you go they inherit your evil. <laughs> you go they inherit them. For those who want to understand what they talk, let's watch this video. Information reaching us right now is that the EFCC is selling off all of our uh, former governor of Anambra State, William Obiano's property in Anambra State. And uh, the video you're watching now, this is one of the properties. This is one of the mansions. They've sealed off this one. And the information we are hearing that they've also sealed off other properties. You can see here, they are writing here under investigation. You know, EFCC, keep off. Keep off. You know, so it's reported that other properties have also been sealed off. His bank account has been frozen. His uh, passport has been collected for him. He said that he will not be able to run away from Nigeria. Mm. So William Biano is under very serious investigation. He regained, uh, he had a bill. He, he was able to meet bail condition. He was granted bail today. And still today, he his property was confiscated. Ah. You know. So the EFC is accusing gov uh, the former governor of Anambra State, William Biano, of embezzling 47 billion Naira, that most of those money billion. were security votes and also um, local government chairman funds, you know, the allocation that were given to local government chairman and also he also inflated the the money he used in building airports, you know, the Anambra airport, which he nearly renamed to himself. Ah. So guys, just watch this video right now, then I'll be back. This is Obiano. The FCC was there yesterday and uh, they sealed one of the property. According to the FCC, it's under investigation. You can see it there. You can see the FCC keep up. The building is under investigation. Yeah. This street is named after Obiano son. Obiano son. This is another one. Landed properties and any empty plot. Allegedly owned by Obiano. Okay. Come on. This is one of the buildings, Obiano building, sealed by EFCC. It's located at Ingozeka Housing Estate. You know, EFCC came here yesterday and they sealed the property. You can see the EFCC. Yes, this is the building. You can see the EFCC here. EFCC. EFCC. Keep up. Keep up. They say keep up. Yeah. Prince Road. Yeah. All right, guys. So, like we said, the EFCC is sealing off all of Obiano's property. And uh, Soludo lamented that was the day before yesterday when he appeared on a rise television live interview he complained that the only money he saw in government post was only 300 million naira imagine a whole state having only 300 million naira i mean it's so shameful i don't know why these governors are this wicked they are so heartless i don't know why they they, they derive pleasure in looting a state to which they don't even own they don't this state does not belong to them it belongs to the people and this people derive pleasure in looting the state it is it is i don't know i don't know how to describe it i'm short of words but it's such a wicked thing and the EFCC and number of people should make sure that the EFCC recovers that money for them because if it doesn't i mean how will soludo which i see and a lot of people see to be one of the best governors in the whole southeast if not in nigeria although he has not even started self he hasn't started not even up to a week, but his good intention he has has made people to already pass a vote of confidence on him. That's I mean, right. So, Ludo. Oh, no, I don't see the video. 
Make I tell majority of our leaders in Africa, majority of our leaders in Nigeria, immediately they enter, they enter into power, they enter that position. He got spirit one day, one day, one day enter them, one spirit. He got one particular spirit. Now, majority of them, oh, I'm not saying all, oh, but majority of them, hence they don't give them, I am the governor. He got spirit when they enter them. Now, it be the spirit of selfishness, <laughs> the spirit of greed. Ayuku, the spirit of looting, he go enter them. He is the most enter majority of them. Majority, majority of the governor. You will see some of some of the governor, you can think, whether I Ganduje or whatever, one of the governor went and catch, when they carry dollar, they put inside a they take bribe, they put inside a daughter, he go put inside We saw the video that time. Then God acquire this word, I don't know for how many generations, whether a hundred generations to come. But they know so far, now which I don't understand. But make could understand one particular thing. Nothing lasts forever. Even life that God gave to you don't last forever. <laughs> you see life? This life, this era they preach, this life, when we get so, it doesn't last forever. One day, it go quench. You see? So if life, divine God, an almighty God has given to you, that one day it will quench. <laughs> what do you mean position and power? Huh? So if you enter the always remember that position, within some years, you go, you go leave and you go come out. <laughs> if you don't feel, if you don't feel they take like that, you're going to do a pattern. But if you don't say one day, this power, when they take oppressed people, this power, when they take loot people money, the poor people will be suffering this day. Look at Anambra. Go see their road. The road mess up. Nothing, no job. I borrow everywhere. People go graduate, no job. I'm telling you the truth. Teeth full everywhere because people are hungry. Then somebody they carry 47 billion naira. <laughs> they investigate you of 47 billion, one person. One person. Why you not tell your wife? Why you not tell your wife? Where go slap EFCC? Not be, not be, not be slapology, Len. He learns slapology now. You for, you for contact your wife now. May, may, may go slap. If not only your wife self, you don't need to make that they, they tell the investigation because that woman they do pompous too much. If they do pompous, if not the last thing when it's made on your last day alone, you need to investigate on one. On one know well. I don't know well. You see, you they you they you they carry one one whole street. You they you they put the name of your son. Say now the name of your son now be that street. You they name a street after your own son. What do you what did your son don't do for Nigeria? What did your son don't do for Anambra? Why you they name why you they name why you they put the name on a street? Why you they name a name put the name after a street? Who it be? You see, you see, Unwa, 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 that power. It's all about you. It's all about your family. It's all about you. It's all about your family. You've been looting, looting, looting. 47 billion naira. It's a shame. Now, the new governor come now. He, 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 he stress himself to find money. He de stress himself. Not only, not only 300, 300 million naira remain. Meanwhile, one person, they carry 47 billion. You see? You see, you see how now they run the state? The money one day for the, the, the state treasury, when I go divide them into 10, take nine. <laughs> when I go use one, they, they work for we, the poor people. Now, the problem, how would they get with that one? But always remember one day, Nemesis will cut up with you. Like I said, don't catch up with you now. Everything when you get, when you when you get, when you they use the power they acquire, they loot, they confiscated. Everything they don't take them. They don't lock all of them. You know, say so you your mansion, mansion lock, mansion. They, they, see, you don't know Nigeria. They go mention say and bring you to zero level where you start from before they leave you. <laughs> I don't make me like some of them, but when they enter your case, your case you don't finish. Sometimes I like Nigeria. I like as soon as they do nothing. No, no, no two ways about that. No, be, no the only Baba thing with the talk, no. So for this particular one, Nigerian government and EFCC, kudos fighting this corruption. Kudos. And if this uh, this uh, will you be you know, this this past outgone outgone uh, an unblasted governor, if you do well, why is it that Igbo people, Igbo people are not fighting for you? Igbo people are even happy that they are investigating you. Can you, you don't see that video, you know what I'm even an unblasted people, the Anambarians are very happy that they, they, they arrested you, they are confiscating your things, they are, that they are investigating you. If you did well and the state is happening with you, you can see the state they cry and say, why are you investigating him? He did a good job. He did well for us. You will see some people, even though, even though 
Even at 20 percent of the, the the state people come and they they propose you or they they, they back you up. No one person talk good about you for for your eight years of tenure. No one no one person talk good about you. Now looting 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 when you loot. Now now they talk. Now you make them. Now you make them. When the day the day when they come out for power or when you come out for power, now you want to go to America. Now 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 you got to come catch you for airport. Now only God go fix solve our problem. Guys, if you love what I do, don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel. Follow me on Facebook and Instagram and Twitter. All I'm on political. I love you guys. Peace out.